hear me out here because it might actually be the return of Impel down for OPO8. There's been a lot of discussion around tech against Nami and how good it is. And I think there's going to be a lot of big decks that come out, a lot of big characters coming out and people are going to look to starve or be aggressive. Now, if Dofi is going to be the top of the roost, as a lot of people think, these gum gum red rocks that I have in the list may just end up being gravity blades. But largely speaking, it feels like a lot of players are looking to play pudding in the blue matchups. Gion is just going to be a tough one, which is why I'm playing removal. But then also they might be looking to starve the Nami player and play bigger stuff, which is why Deathwink is actually much better. Specifically against pudding, if you have Mr. One to get searched up by Buggy to recur your gum gum gavels, your hand is going to be relatively low. And then with that, you don't have to make proactive moves. You can just hyper enable a Deathwing. Honestly, based on the games today, it might actually in OP08 be the great return of Impel Down Nami and Deathwing. But let me know what you think in the comments down below. Playing some Impel Down Nami. I'm going to keep this one. I'm going to keep this one. This is going to be an interesting one. Ended off OP08 though. We, we, we done with largely we're done with seven. We still I mean, some folks still have, you know, treasure cup here and there and everything. So we definitely will be playing some games and we end it off. But, you know, my mind right now is like you know, I'm thinking about. who I got to I got a plan for and all that stuff. So let's deploy this. Let's grab ourselves uh, one of these just because we definitely don't want to be drawing that late game just past the turn i mean we got gavel pitch a bunch of stuff here we can really start making some things work for us here if this is black like i just we got no cards in our trash like they can return some things to the bottom but we'll be able to get there we'll be able to get there they're definitely and they're definitely not you know they're they're not going to be used to like what what we're doing because we're we're just going to be like pitch 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 Okay, plus four cost. I mean, I'll throw this out and then pass. If they're trying to build out a board fair enough, it's just against these type of strategies right now where if everyone is going to be looking to starve the Nami player, I mean, just having Deathwink, like it's, it's going to be naturally that much better. And I mean, hey, they're playing out all their Luchis right now. So once we get our Kayas out, it's going to look a lot better. We do have two red rocks in here. Could use one of them for this jack. Let's see. Yep, they will kill that. We don't really have a way to recur it, so that's fine. Let's see, let's see how they start swinging here. Do they swing sixes? It's probably a good place to start. Because my white snake does get you. If I have double white double white snake, that would be the real bee's knees here. I could try and dig for one seen another one yet opponent really thinking about it oh the double white snake is good it's good i yo i mean we're, we're just gonna pass like if this is the game you want to play i guess you want to replace the span down with something that can swing a little bit better so let's start off with this first because we're just gonna get this out of the way and then i will pitch this so we're, we're gonna start this off like you have to like this spandam i don't even want attacking right it's just it's just one of those things i don't even want the spandam attacking 10k all right gavel pitch to 11. fair enough 9k gavel pitch again drop them I will trash this. It's just not looking good, opponent. It's not looking good right now. Okay, yeah, trying to give some minus some minus one cost. Yep. Uh, honestly, gonna bottom deck these. It's not cards I'm looking for right now. I'm looking for like Mister One. Okay, nice. Okay, so honestly, this is not looking that great. I already put a peel off and a Kaya at the bottom, so. When I, when, when I, once I put this down there, I'm I'm supposed to know the top 11 cards in my deck right now, and it's honestly not looking too great. So let's see what happens here. I'm not I'm not going to press them. We're at 24 cards, five life. We can start going a little bit deeper. 
Um, I think based on our Dawn here, we can go 5-3. Like, we can really... Really depends on how we draw this, but we'll pitch a Deathwink. Just to start off, we'll pitch a Deathwink. Yep. That's not great. Yep. Okay, I'm going to take some hits. Truly the most inopportune time to draw any of that. Like, all right, Deathwing counter out of that. That is insane. Wow. Okay. First of all, like just holy, like, okay. Um, I mean, it's still, it's still not the end of the world. Uh, we know the top 11, if we can get there, uh, that'd be nice. Right. draw so now we kind of know it from there so we know what we're about to draw right now we're no we know what we're about to draw so we're just gonna okay all right opponent really really going for it here yep okay that's not great our triggers just have not been good at all if i'm gonna be honest here So I know we can pull out this, which is good. Seven cards left. We go two. Uh... Hold on. Did I actually mess this up? I might have messed this up. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. All right. Yeah, yeah. No, I was like, wait, where's the rubber band? Because I put a rubber band down there. I was like, where did I put the rubber band? Whew, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. I almost, I almost messed that one up. I was like, that's what I was thinking of. Like, okay, I can't do the whole like gavel thing. Where did I put that rubber band? Whew, we got there. Okay. Um, if they brook me, sure. Um, yeah, if they brook me here, all right, but GG's. Woo, almost messed that one up. Um, all right. Yeah. Okay. All right. GG's. We playing some boa, not with that hand though. I don't need to start off with like double red rock. That's a little crazy. Do we have a Kaya? So I'll play around blue a little bit. All right. Some bugster. All right, all right, all right. Got the bugster. Got the bugster. Um. I don't just want to drop Mr. One in this case, like truthfully. See how they swing out. Yeah, I was gonna say hopefully I can just use this. That'd be great. If they attach three down, I was gonna say if they attach three down to buggy, you're 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 ill. You're mentally ill if you attach three down to buggy. <laughs> it's like it's not it's not that desperate, like truthfully. So we're gonna go to five cards, peel off, go to six. Yeah. Just pass through. Pudding doesn't get like the most value here so that's kind of what i like about this build it's like if people are going to start teching pudding which is a more common tech then we just have like good options versus it um i'll bottom deck this kaya i don't really care like do it yeah um yeah i'll bottom deck this kaya i'll take a hit Go oh, gavel pitch one of these. Oh no, peel off. Take that. That's fine. Nothing off the Jimbe. I actually just took that in. Did they misclick that? I, I I just. Oh no no. Sorry. They played the. 
what am I saying? They played thing off that. It wasn't anything. It wasn't nothing off the gym bay. Yeah, yeah. What am I saying? It wasn't. It wasn't nothing off the gym bay. We're five cards though. That's fine. Yep, gym bay. Play him again. Doesn't do anything right now. It's what I like. Yep. Play another bugster. Yep. Start drawing some cards if they want. And they could just, honestly, they could just put it back in their hand for the sake of like drawing a card if they wanted to. They could just do it for the sake of doing that. Okay. Uh, we'll go gavel pitch this. Gotta move through the deck, you know? Yep. Gavel pitch this. Yep. Attach two dawn, attack into this. That forces two cards out of their hand, if anything. All right, nice. Killed one of those. Hoping to honestly just draw a character, like a white snake or like a... What is this? Oh, this is the blocker. Oh, this is... Oh, no. Wait, look at the top three cards of your deck, then place... One of the, then place them in any order on the top or bottom, then give it to one of your, someone was kind of, uh, to one rested dawn. Oh, this is cool. Wait, ST17. Yo, because I, I was hearing some stuff about how Dofi's like going to get kind of like busted. Yo, this card is insane though. Like actually, card's kind of crazy. Honestly, card goes kind of hard. What the hell? Okay, let's try opponent. Try again. Try that one again. Sorry about that. Yup. Sorry about that. Go six. All Deathwing. Instant speed pilafs. Instant speed pilafs. It's good vibes. A good. It, it, it's good vibes all around. Instant speed pilafs. Talking to the bugster. Oh, they can block. What am I doing? Yeah, okay. Anyway, it's probably better. Okay. Now I can kill this. Not even, I'm not even thinking about this optimally, honestly. I mean, this block was thing. I forgot this had blocker. I, I genuinely forgot this had blocker. I would have I attached one more Dawn into it. Oh, well, uh, looks like we're taking a hit here. We're at 21 cards for life. Looks like we're taking a hit here. Um, these are the situations where we need our death winks. But we've already used three. No, just two. Yeah, a lot of our buggies are gone, though. So we're just kind of drawing 2k counters. Unfortunate. Okay, that's that's fine. That can go. this actually don't mind that they do it like this so if i ru trigger rubber band uh i can peel off i can draw the peel off if i trigger rubber band all right you're good just just raw swing oh okay nice does that play that yeah yeah, okay. Nice. Okay, so you get one hit into me. Oh, you choose not to. Interesting. Okay. Um you okay. Fair enough. Uh we're gonna be taking some hits here. They emptied us out pretty well. That's unfortunate. <sighs> Shouldn't have used this. Then I would have been able to counter that out pretty well here. Having to rely on Deathwink right now, which is not great at all. Uh, let's drop this and drop this. Let's grab this to... 
grab the gavel and uh pass through we're at three life i'm surprised they didn't swing more i'm kind of concerned i'm kind of concerned they didn't swing more like that doesn't really make a lot of sense to me okay why not bottom deck the okay i don't know why they didn't bottom deck the kaya but okay i mean i guess i guess we got some stuff and things we got some stuff and things Take the hit. Right, this thing has banish. Yeah, that's fine. I'll take the hit. Right, and then we'll redraw here. Yo! Nah, cause that's insane! No, 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 no. I need y'all to witness this. That's insane! What did I just draw? Nah, cause that's wild. I'm not winning this. That's so cooked. Cause. All right, I'm calling it there. I've got this. We're going, we're going to the next one. That's nah, that's crazy. Oh my god. Oh my god. Eustace kid from ST10. Um I'll 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 run this. I'll run this. It's not the worst in the world. Alright, killer. Made it happen. Draw wire. Okay. Uh pass him. We have stuff and things that we can be doing. Okay. Lose a death link. We will well in the turn. Uh I might be able to just get away with some white snakes here. Like two white snakes. Might just be able to kind of do the job here. Let's see what they do. Dawn minus, and then this leader becomes like a six K swing. It's fun. Uh okay, yep. Got a Dawn minus. Yeah, eight K swing. So here we can go gavel pitch this. Oh my lord, we are losing. Okay. All right, we're drawing too many of our death winks. I'm gonna be honest, we're drawing a little too many of them. Okay, let's not do that anymore. We've gone through three death winks off the top ten cards of our library so far, off our deck so far. Okay. Opponent, opponent, just really. Seeing uh seeing the better side of variants here. Yep, they're gonna draw a discard and they're gonna get <laughs> and they're gonna get the dawn back. It's good, it's good, it's good synergy, it's good synergy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You get to do a lot. You get to do a lot. Purple just got a got a lot of a lot of cool synergies once it once it really like starts to get going. Yeah, we're just gonna we're we're gonna drop these uh Oh, okay. I guess we're just not using any of our white snakes. <laughs> I guess we're just not using any of our white snakes. Swing into that. Blocking counter out. All right, love it. Something we don't got to deal with. Something we don't got to deal with. Oh, baby, the monkey D dragon. Coming at us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 8K for free? Come on, opponent. No way. Ain't no way you're giving this one to me for free. All right, take that one. Definitely drop that. Love me a good Kaya. For free. Yep. So that brings you up to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, for free. Come on. 20 cards for life. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's the dream right there. That's what we call the dream right there. Honestly? Kaya might have been a mistake to be honest. 
because now I can't use the death link. Um, I purposely like dropped cards that I didn't want to use. I probably it's like I could have got I might have been able to get away with just using um, red rock. I'm at 10 cards, though. I think I think I largely should be OK here. All things considered. Why did I wait? What? No, I wanted to. What? I wanted a rubber band. Oh, my Lord. Shaf, 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 Shaf. What are you doing? I wanted to rubber band. I did not want a death wink. That's not good. That is not good. Because I know I have two gavels at the bottom. That's not what I wanted. Hidden killer. Okay. Okay, that helps. That helps. That helps. So this can't attack. I know that much. So I can counter out of that. Okay. See this right here? This is what we call a mistake. Okay. And then now we win. Now we win. I mean, I believe we don't have a grabbable. Oh, we do. Um, okay. I mean, we're just going to play this. We're going to grab our gavel. And that's it. That's the game. That's the Yeah. No, we just, we found that. Um... Okay, it's a bit of a small mistake, but it seems like like honestly Deathwink is kind of good here. Honestly, it just feels like we've had good experiences with Deathwink so far. All right, GG's. Would love to play against some Kata, not with that hand though. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I don't actually know if it got worse or it got better. I think it got worse. <laughs> I think this hand got worse, technically speaking. All right, we'll take the 9K swing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, you get you got a freebie. You gotta you you get a freebie. You get a freebie. It's gonna have to be the 2k. Alright. Um pass the turn. At least though, like I will say. Okay, so they can go 9k into this, which is fine. We can counter out of this. Do we just go to 10 with this? I think so. Right? And then I think we're just supposed to do this. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. So now I can do this. And then do this. Go drop one of these. Let me be honest, probably drop this. Because uh, this can help us find the the buggy can help us find Mr. One and Mr. One will give us a gavel back because we're going to start needing gavels uh, to get rid of stuff like Sanji's pilaf. OK, they're swinging big here. So we go gavel pitch. And then 2K. Honestly, the like one thing I will say out of the whole Kuja Pirates build, like I, I mean, so for real, it really taught me personally the value of a of a searchable 2k it really did um and, and i can't i can't like state that enough it really taught me the value of a searchable 2k um and that's kind of why i'm playing prince bellet like i feel like like you could be playing mr uh i think it's mr two um Yep, count out of that. You could be playing, um, like you could be playing the five cost, but I don't think it's like that crazy to be playing this too, because I think there's like a small world where like, uh, here, do this. I think we'll just pass. Uh, I think, I think. That was a mistake. I should have just played Impel down. I should have just played Impel down. Okay. 
feel that. Like, I'm kind of saving Red Rock for, like, something big here. Okay. At least now the, the beam is on. Nice. Yeah, I can't count out of this, so I'll just take it. Uh, no trigger. There's Kaya. Drop these two, Kaya. Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, in this case, we just pass through. We're at thirteen cards, three life. That's the beautiful thing about this list. Like, you're just able to go through your deck like so fast. Like fast. That's the thing. Like, like Deathwing just really is like one of the better ways that we have to. Um. Okay. All right. That's not really what I'm looking. But okay. Uh, mm. Okay. So we'll take a hit. Yep. Yeah, we'll take the hit. I mean, we might as well, right? Okay. So we can counter out of this, which is nice. Right. It, we're we're going to be solo on cards here, which is nice. Draw. Uh, I think I might as well. I might I might as well overpay for it. Um. Okay. All right. End the turn. We're at two cards. Or uh, three cards, I should say. We're, we're gonna be able to draw one. I forgot what's at the bottom. Honestly, I forgot what's at the bottom. Yep. Let's redraw here. Nice. Might just be able to honestly, we might just be able to win on this swing here. Uh yeah, we just win here. Start by pushing cards on top, return to the deck, and then Deathwink to the end. Honestly, yo, honestly, 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 Deathwink. OP08 might be the great return of Deathwink. Just saying. OP08 might be the great return of Deathwink. I don't know. It's the 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 it's I'm talking, yo, any, any way I can bring back instant speed peel off. Yo, let's run one more. Let's run one more up against King. I'm kind of down for it. Cause this, this is going to be, this is going to be one of those 08 leaders that we are going to kind of see a fair amount. A lot of, a lot of good abilities here. Um, yeah. So we'll get off free one of these. Yeah. Okay a lot here they're, they're doing a doing a lot uh we'll take that hit yeah that's fine we'll peek through grab this this hand sucks i'll be honest um yeah we can do this pretty profitably yeah all right let's just play out the peel-offs now like while they only have one character out let's let's play out our peel-offs all right uh, can I counter out of this? I can go to 9. I can go to 11. I can't. All right, take it. I mean, if they're not going to play anything, like, all right. Honestly, if they're not going to play anything, I'm already at 3. It's, it, it's honestly not great. It's not great. They could start playing some massive things, but, like, they're good to punish me for this. Because uh, they know. I think a lot of other players would not punish the Nami player by doing all this. Also, my triggers have been, like, terrible, to be fair, so... Let's do that and pass. I can spend a whole turn doing that. Let's just stop it. Yeah. Okay. What were you? Yeah. All right. Um, we just have 15 cards in hand. Um, let's Kaya. Definitely drop one of these and drop this. It's getting a little, getting a little ridiculous. We're able to use one of our red rocks. Interesting the way that they're playing this right now, honestly. Yeah. Then we can white snake to counter out of this attack. Then we can go gavel pitch here. Crash, and then we can go counter, 
counter counter maybe a little aggressive but i'm just i'm not letting you get these big swings on me for free yeah i'm just i'm not letting you do this for free i'm at 21 cards yeah i don't i officially just don't have gavels anymore like access to those like i lost well i shouldn't say officially but i lost access to a bunch of them here cards on top Yeah, honestly, keep these. And then we can trash here. We can trash here. And then we can redraw to 20. Like, they can keep doing this. It's fine. Because I'm going to do this. Pull this. Gavel. grab rubber band okay all right 15 our opponent's got an interesting strat three life 15 life we've managed to kind of counter out of everything for this long we don't have any more white snakes so that's something to keep in mind uh we will go gavel pitch and then i want to see what i can set up here Honestly, don't want these. Not right now, anyway. I actually did the math wrong on that. I actually thought I could counter out of that. That was a bit of a mistake. I thought I could counter out of that. Okay. It's better than nothing to pull a card out. Let's push the Kaya's back up top. Yeah, let's push the Kaya's back up top. Right? So we're still at two life. If they hit me, I'll take it. Because I just need to draw cards now. Uh, I'll probably just... Uh, let's see how they do this. They, they've had an interesting strat this whole time. Uh, Sure. It doesn't really matter in this case. I, I can't count out of it anyway. Nor do I really want to. So we'll let that resolve. Regardless though, uh, this should be the win. That's it. All right. Our opponent, interesting route, but it really goes to show you whether or not it was correct. If you're swinging large and you're starving the Nami player, Deathwink is exactly good at stopping that just because of how much it can counter out. And again, with Mr. One, you just get to do so many greedy things. Like you get to keep the greediest hands and you get to draw through your deck like so much better. You don't have to be proactive. You can be reactive um, and, and really like churn through your deck. It always felt like if you draw kind of at a medium level with this strategy, it really just does feel like your your hand can always be topped up like instant again instant pe speed peel off so good so good right now um yeah i don't know I, it might be it might be time for a comeback might be time for a comeback